This is Joku Store. Here we have the Waffle House, a common sight throughout America. Here we see the desperate, the hungover, and the hungry. And here we see the man who has lost a wager. He has to spend the next 24 hours in the Waffle House. For every waffle he eats, he will shave one hour off his ordeal. I'm coming to you live from Brandon, Mississippi, Waffle House. I, a total loser, came in last place in my fantasy football league. As punishment, I must spend 24 hours in Waffle House. Every waffle I eat shaves an hour off the clock. It's 4.07 Central. It is now his suffering begins. Waffle after waffle arrive on his plate. Now, he will know the true meaning of pain. Figured I'd enjoy the first two. Two down. That means two hours down. 21.37 hours left. Already my stomach is rumbling. Gonna be long one. The staff does not believe me that I'll stay here that long. Little do they know. One hour, ten minutes into it. Two more waffles and one human who is dead on the inside. The waffles come at a fast and furious pace. They do not abate. Four waffles down. Been here 1.5 hours, so that means I have 18.5 to go. I'm already in immense discomfort. Please, somebody launch me into the sun. Two children, can't be older than six, are up at the touch tunes. Absolutely jazzed to hear whatever bangers they picked out as soon as Enter Sandman finishes. And it's Eye of the Tiger. Hell yeah, let's get another waffle. And now it's Hotel California. How fitting. I can check out anytime I want, but I can never leave. Yes, I can in 17 hours. Officially stuck in neutral. Need to find that extra gear to push through this waffle. T's and P's, please. 7.07 Central Time. Three hours. 4.75 waffles down. So many hours to go. His pain is only just beginning. Soon, this waffle house will become his own personal hall. Found that extra something and polished off Waffle 5. That's five hours shaved off and an incredible amount of agony for my intestines. 16 hours to go. Gonna take 45 minutes and let the body rest before attacking that crucial sixth waffle. Y'all, they're going down like cement now and the heart is beating real heavy like. I'm the only non-employee in here. Got half a waffle number six left. So many hours. Damn, this sixth waffle is not going down. Got my first shift change here. And homies are getting a good tip. Looking to rally here. Six hours down. I am still on waffle six. I think a trip to the parking lot for a little puke and rally is in order. Let's go. Waffle number six has been consumed. And the music came back on. Twelve hours to go. Pushing through the halfway mark, he now finds the inner fortitude to continue in his quest. Quick little trip to the bushes outside, if you know what I'm saying. Now, back into the breach. Hello. It's hour seven. Where we stand. Six waffles consumed. Eleven hours remain. Insides are in shambles. But two kind Mississippians came in and gave me some rollates. Shout out, those people. Your boy is in pain. <laughs> Remember when I ordered my seventh waffle? Full crash and burn. Not gonna finish it. My body is in revolt, shutting down. It's time to sit out for a while. Gotta rest up for the stretch run. Right now, I'm on pace to leave. 10.07 a.m. Central Time. Full of waffles, but devoid of life. Gonna ride the next few hours out from the comforts of the parking lot because my phone needs to charge. I'll let everyone know when I get back on the Horus. Hoping to make a strong push around 6.30 to get this thing in the house. What's up? Back from my brief stint getting some phone juice. Got some coffee in an effort to get things moving. Sorry to the haters who thought I'd spend the night sleeping. And now he is preparing himself for this stretch run. This is the most difficult time in this challenge. It will take the utmost intestinal fortitude to be successful. We've entered peak boredom hours. All the staff went out for their smoke breaks. 
This Waffle House doesn't feel like a Waffle Home with no one here. Waffle number seven was easily the worst tasting one, but I finally put it down. Maybe it'll come back up soon. Who can say? Seven-ish hours to go. Enjoying another cup of coffee, trying to make some room. Beyond the utter and total discomfort I feel, Waffle House is pretty peaceful right now. Kind of zen. Not touching number eight for at least an hour. Six hours to go. Deep into the doldrums of the night now. It's 4.07 a.m. I have five hours to go. And I'm out of shutdown Fulka's episodes. And the crossword I was doing is mad best. At six, I'm going to order two waffles and try to get them down. That would bring me up to nine and get me out of here by seven. Okay, I have four hours left. Again, the plan here is to order two waffles at 6 a.m. Central Time and get out of here at 7. That would be nine waffles and an amount of calories I don't want to think about. Miley Cyrus, the climb is playing in this Waffle House and I think it's time to try to put down those last two waffles and go home. This was real. At times it was fun, but it was never really fun. And so the last two waffles arrive. Will this man fulfill his destiny, or will he be the mockery of his fantasy football league? Let's do this! I can report progress. One waffle down, that makes eight. One to go, then we're just running out the clock until 7 a.m. This is not enjoyable. All that stands between me and going home in the next 30 minutes. So damn close. And then, as if almost scripted, signs of mockery emerge. Who logged into touch tunes to play Homeward Bound? The sun is rising. It's a new day and I'm never eating waffles again. That's nine waffles in 15 hours in this restaurant. Shout out to the staff for letting me hang out on a slow night. I tipped them well, don't worry. This was horrible and I recommend no one ever do this. And we're out. And so the saga concludes. The man emerges triumphant from the Waffle House, holding his head up high with great dignity. This is Jacques Cousteau. I bid you all au revoir.